difference to today's setup in the morning i created a setup like selling on and buying so and uh, here i purchased it and sees and then exited and around 1 o'clock the market started moving and for and at 43000 you see like it gave a 3000 move 300 moves uh, why because this has happened a short covering so if you see on the option chart right and uh, this black one is a bank nifty this one is red one is ce and the pe is the blue one so you see how the market uh, when the market started moving the ce or the shortest 43 ce shortest they started to cover and because of that you see like this short covering has happened so initially i started with um, with this uh, 426000 600 ce and at 7600 quantity right and if you see it ended at at 651 so if i would have kept it till the end i would have got 1.2 lakhs uh, simply but unfortunately i did not uh, follow through the whole uh, uh, you know um, trading and only ended with 2. Point, uh, or you can say 3000 i only traded in cs uh, basically there were two p trades where i actually it hit my stop loss but ultimately i ended the day as a green and uh, after like 235 i did not trade even though i was bullish i couldn't you know um, take the benefit out of it right so the setup is very simple whenever you see like uh, for example first thing is what you do is you will take the highest candle from right to left you start so that let's say next day you'll come and this is the highest candle right so you'll take the top of it and the body this is one and you'll find the last or you can say first down or you can say the down move so this one will be the next one so this and here you'll create a so buying and selling now this has increased the way a limit a lot right so you can go on more like 3 minute chart or 1 minute chart and about that second part is very interesting today it was like it was following the fibonacci actually so uh, hold on if you see the fibonacci right um i'm sorry so if you if you bow ah so so if you see here from here if you start it and you take it like this right from here and if you plot it just let me So you see, market was hovering around 3.2, and the moment it broke this light, it kept scaling up. And 0.68, right? Generally, market will come down, but it did not, and it kept scaling up. So today, market was very bullish, and I think market is still in that, uh, you know, and in uptrend and uh, uh, like the fall and everything was needed. But uh, uh, market, like when it fell, it it was just uh, some correction, and now still market is scaling up. So I think new high. we'll see uh, if it goes every well i think we are going to see a new high don't short this market try to be on the buy on dips for now because there are very good candles uh, and i think after new high then only we'll be seeing some good corrections or something like that and uh, don't forget like first february the budget will come so uh, the market will scale up and then market will maybe go in consolidation zone or it will wait for the budget you know uh for for uh, for for the budget to over and have a directional move so ultimately i think uh, a new high is due okay and today even though um, i mean i was my setup was telling me to stay long i couldn't hold it uh, the trade but uh, if i would have done that i would have ended up in a very good profit but that's part of game that's it and also like this part right i was able to see it um, very clearly like where the market well, where the shorters are you know covering their shorts So I could have taken a CE short, uh, C forty three thousand of forty three three hundred, but I did not take it. So um, that's okay. But it it was clearly visible that shorters are running for cover. The CE shorters are running for cover because markets moved even way beyond their expectations, right? So it was a good day uh, for bulls. Bears again are now um, waiting for their time. So thank you, thanks a lot. Keep watching. Please subscribe. Please share with your friends. Thank you.